What is the true cost of conflict? As we examine the ongoing strife in Ukraine, we're compelled to question the role of the United States in this volatile equation. The Belarusian president, Alexander Lukashenko, during a recent interaction with students at the Belarusian State University of Informatics and Radio Electronics, delivered a poignant message. He implored the necessity to end the war in Ukraine, to establish boundaries, and to negotiate peace. He claimed that the scars of World War II and the Great Patriotic War have healed over time, and so will the wounds of Ukrainians. The pressing question, however, is how much further will we tread this path of destruction? Lukashenko openly admits maintaining contact with Ukraine, striving to pacify the situation. However, he criticizes Ukrainian President Zelensky for his deafness to these peace calls. Why? Lukashenko points a finger at the United States. According to him, the ongoing conflict serves American interests by weakening Europe, which, contrary to popular belief, is not part of the same big family. In his view, the United States profits from the war in Ukraine. It fuels their military-industrial complex and keeps the money circulating within their borders. The humanitarian cost, however, is overlooked. The United States, Lukashenko claims, is reluctant to face the direct repercussions of war and thus proxies it through Ukraine. Lukashenko also cites the missed opportunity of a prosperous partnership between high-tech Western Europe and resource-rich Russia. Instead, he observes Germany is being forced to shut down plants and factories due to competition. So what could be the potential consequences of continued U.S. involvement in the Ukraine conflict? The escalation of conflict, economic strain, risk of a broader war, diplomatic strain, and detrimental humanitarian impact are all plausible outcomes. Not to mention, Ukraine could become overly dependent on U.S. aid, hindering its ability to develop a self-sufficient defense capability. In conclusion, as we revisit the Ukraine conflict, we're left pondering the profound words of President Lukashenko and the potential repercussions of U.S. involvement. The true cost of conflict is not just economic or political, but also deeply human. And perhaps it's high time we start putting humanity before profits.